And now, live from the Coca-Cola Southwest Beverages Porch. Hey, welcome to the porch, everyone. It is 614, the Moore Police Department hosting a big free event coming up. We love free. It is the Burgers and Badges event next Thursday, March 14th. Joining us this morning, Chief of Police Todd Gibson and Sergeant Rebecca Miller. Thanks for joining us. Thank you for having us. We appreciate it. I said free because that really catches everyone's attention. Yeah. Talk mm -hmm. to us about this event. What is Burgers and Badges? Well, Burgers and Badges is just a, a good community event mm -hmm. where we can reach out and we can connect and engage with our community it's heavily focused on kids and families and so it's a strong family environment we want everybody to come out and enjoy themselves but it also gives us an opportunity to, to find out what they need from us mm -hmm. and build that relationship with our community yeah why is that so important that relationship with the community especially in a, a time not of emergency just time to talk and get to know each other it's just it's good to be able to talk to the community mm -hmm. and like we said, we focus on the children, so mm -hmm. we hope that by interacting with them, they wouldn't fear us or they'd come to us if they need us. Mm -hmm. What have you learned? Uh, this uh, three years, I think, this event has been going on. Correct. What have you What have you guys gleaned from this? What are you What are you getting each time from this event? Well, the biggest thing that we get from this, whenever we um, uh, have these, is the importance of that connection. Mm -hmm. And really, uh, the police are just a tool and to partner with the community to help make the community better. We believe that we are going to enhance our community by making positive individual impacts. And mm -hmm. so, if we can make a positive impact on a child, positive impact impact on a family, mm -hmm. the, the consequence of that is going to be a better community. Yeah. Rebecca, mm -hmm. what um, what do you want folks to know, like what all will be there? Obviously burgers. Mm -hmm. What else for family friendly? So it's burgers, hot dogs, mm -hmm. um, we'll have snow cones for the kids, mm -hmm. there's going to be bounce houses, face painting, oh. there's a multiple different activities that we're going to have. Also we're giving away 30 free bicycles. Oh, wow. Okay, mm -hmm. how does that work? It'll be, we don't know yet, okay. but there, <laughs> there's going to be 30 kids with new bicycles. <laughs> I so. love that. That is <laughs> awesome. How many folks typically come out? Um, well, the first year we had a few hundred. Okay. Uh, the last mm -hmm. time we did it, we had close to 2,000 people show up. That's yeah. awesome. Yeah. We had to go out and buy more hamburgers. That's a good problem to have, honestly. Yes, great <laughs> It was busy. Okay, uh, we got about 15 seconds left. Uh, where, what time, what do folks need to know? So it's next Thursday okay. at 12th and Janeway from 6 to 8. Mm -hmm. We'll cook food, burgers, and hot dogs as long as we have them and uh, want everybody to come out and enjoy it. Awesome. Thank you so much for coming out. More police department. Go support them next Thursday. We just need some good weather so that that event goes great. Robin? Oh, my gosh, yes. We love that idea. Burgers and uh, having a good time with the police officers. Thanks for sharing that, Lacey, so much. If you have an organization or a community event you want to see highlighted on the Coca-Cola porch, submit your story to news9.com slash porch.